Alright my fellow degenerates, today we are going to be checking out the only subreddit where handling a very dangerous flamethrower while you're wearing a synthetically made fursuit is always going to be a bad idea. It's r slash furry IRL. More anxiety for fire, damn it. My non-furry friend, what exactly do furries do for fun? Me, using a flamethrower to make creme brulee in a fursuit. If it doesn't involve a call to the fire department, it's not considered fun. Although, in all seriousness though, this does not look safe. I'm not saying not safe for work, naughty safe for work, but um, this is not safe for work in a sense that why are you handling such dangerous equipment while you're wearing something very, very flammable? I mean, yeah, one could argue that this furry right here is... Um, an expert in handling such dangerous equipment, but as someone who believes heavily in the Murphy's Law, if bad things are bound to happen, they will happen. And uh, in this scenario, a lot of variables can contribute to something uh, happening that is very, very bad. Now, I'm not saying I want it to happen, I'm saying it could happen. I don't want it to, but it could. This is pretty much the equivalent of a Charmander par partaking in <laughs> partaking in the ice bucket challenge i mean just think about it uh file destination furry edition hey bro look what i wrote all furries do all day is have the naughties with each other mm -hmm. the child what do you mean all furries do all day is have the naughties with each other do you have any idea how lonely i am what are you talking about, furries? All, all they do is have the naughties all day. You have no idea what you're talking about. And you have no idea how much of a virgin I am. But now you know. <laughs> I said it in this video. You child, you deserve to get yeeted. Maximum yeet. Normies be like, what? A dog and a rope? What's funny about it? I don't get it. Furries be like, <laughs> Ah yes, the tried and true joke of a dog and a picture of a knot. If you're a furry and you don't understand this, you're either very innocent, very new, or you've lived under a rock for the past time that you've been a furry. Freddie Mercury. Mama! Everyone in a 50 mile radius. Ooh! I I sometimes wish I'd never been born at all. <laughs> Where the hell is where the hell am I was it going with that run? Jesus Christ! <laughs> uh, you guys know it. You guys know how I how much I love memes or posts that um, obligate me to sing. I always love that. Especially I'm inside of a bathroom. The acoustics in here are freaking amazing. Zoo files, furries. Corbett needs you to find out the difference between this picture and this picture. Non-furries. They're the same picture. No, the hell they're not! Probably one of the biggest common misconceptions of the furry fandom, everyone in it, is that the fact that everyone in the furry fandom has the naughties with animals. Only a select few of them do that, and what we do to those people is we destroy them. Not in a literal sense, by the way, not a very literal sense. We will hunt them down, we will dox them, and we will make sure that they will be banished from the community. There are uh, a number of Twitter pages on Twitter right now that's dedicated to um, abolishing or banning zoo files and maps and everything else that's bad about the furry fandom out of the fandom. And one of them is zoo file struggle tweets. I've worked with them multiple times and their uh, p uh, their system of handling such these such, such people is just amazing okay i want you guys to go to the description uh you can find the zoo file circle tweets uh link a page link in there i want you guys to follow that if you have a twitter and if you do make one and follow them okay they make amazing work my furry friends complaining that their significant other is crap me, being unable to relate because I'm forever single due to the fact that I am a furry. Well, being a furry obviously doesn't have a factor in why you're single. 
I mean, you mentioned before, your furry friends obviously have significant others, you know? And uh, there's like... Actually, no, I can use a lot of uh, other famous furries out there that are currently in a relationship. Um, Luke... I know, uh, Fluke Husky, I'm sorry, Fluke Husky and uh, his boyfriend, uh, I, his name escapes me at the moment, but yeah, they are examples that even though you are a furry, it doesn't mean you have to be single forever, you know? Being a furry, like I said, doesn't have uh, a significant weight in the reason why you're, you're single. Maybe it's because you never put yourself out there, or maybe you haven't found the right person yet. Okay, you just gotta fix yourself. Maybe you gotta just fix yourself, you know? Dressing as my Shrek Sona for ShrekCon got me like. <sighs> this is, um. This is. This is not a Shrek Sona. This is. This is Pickle Rick's illegitimate son with Cardi B. Satan unleashes hellhounds and fury on the earth. Oh god, no! Satan unleashes hellhounds and furry on the earth. Yeah. Mm, and they bought yogurt. Mm. <laughs> uh, to anyone who's ever watched this video, that is not, in fact, yogurt. Well, I mean, it's the kind of yogurt, but in order for you to get it, you're gonna have to shake the container very, very hard. <laughs> scripted by the way <laughs> I'm so sorry <laughs> I don't know how you guys put up with me this is just terrible terrible humor <laughs> me just minding my own business in r slash furry IRL my dad who had gotten reddit without me knowing and is on r slash furry IRL too uh, it kind of looks like both of you are gonna meet eventually and um, you guys are gonna have a lot to talk about. Mainly, why your dad is in furry IRL. And if it does turn out to be that he's a furry as well, you're gonna have a good time. You now have a lot to talk about with your dad. You can make a father-son bonding connection with that. Hell yeah! Awkward moment turned wholesome. Holla! If you could fight any wolf in history, who would you fight? i choose Wolfgar the Terrible, except instead of fighting him, I would become his friend. As his friend, I'd stop him from doing all those terrible things. What about you? My father? Hmm. That's not quite the answer that we're looking for. Please try again next time. I'm sorry if uh, this meme just, just hit a little too close to home to some of you folks at home. <laughs> sorry. And that brings us to the end of r slash furry IRL. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, all that jazz. Follow me on Twitter, chat with me on Discord, support me on Coffee. My coffee link is in the description below. And don't forget to join the official Discord server for my channel. This has been your fellow degenerate Cookboss88, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. Uh, see ya. Stay foxy. Much love.